Good afternoon. This is the weekly video briefing uh, for January 19th, 2017. I hope everybody's doing well, um, and I will just get right into it. Some announcements. Uh, as everyone should know by now that the new uniforms begin being worn at 0800 on Monday, January 23rd, 2017. That's per emails from Chief Trevino regarding uh, the, the whole process beginning one on the 23rd of November, then another one on December uh, 8th. So it should be no surprise to anybody. I uh, want everybody when uh, Chief Rob Weech is going to start on here. He's been onboarding in the last uh, week or so, physical, sieges, all that stuff. His first scheduled work day is January 30th. That's if everything goes all right, so we want to make sure that we uh, make him welcome, and he's got a big job ahead of him, but look out for some new faces. Next week, we have the uh, IAFF Labor Management meeting at some point. It's not got a, a definite schedule yet, but I've talked with the president, and he's setting, we're setting up something for next week. This week, he, uh, the chief was out of t uh, town in Daytona at Fire Rescue East, so that was, wasn't practical to meet together, but we've got several issues we'll talk about. We're, get, we're getting together then. On the good news front, the IAEP pay increases will be effective, were effective this past Monday, the 16th, uh, 2017, and they'll be on the paycheck of February the 3rd. That's the next paycheck after the one tomorrow. And the IAFF were, uh, will be on the paycheck of tomorrow. They were effective January the 2nd, as you guys recall. So some good uh, upcoming opportunities. We, I want to reiterate again that the uh, we're going to do some shift friendly. The county is going to do some shift friendly paramedic classes. They're coordinate with the training facilities around here. Uh, again, that's kind of stuff's on hold this last week, but uh, they've already gotten tentative approval with Polk State, and they're going to go down to South Florida to uh, get those uh, folks on board. And the the again, not not set in stone yet, but pretty much. Uh, Almost a done deal, I'd say. You know, the county's going to pay up front, and the employees are going to sign some type of commitment. And I'm sure there'll be a couple other stipulations that I can't think of right now, but uh, we sure want everyone to take advantage that can, as, as much as the system will will uh, uh, stand up through the f first couple of years, get as many people uh, with their paramedic certification as possible and uh, make it easier on them. And conversely, we're going to do this uh, shift-friendly fire classes. That's in the works also. That's not quite, uh, haven't gotten any commitments out of the uh, training facilities that yet. Hadn't been able to meet with them because of the, some of those personal conflicts that, that occurred the last few weeks. But we'll hope to get back on track and get that started also. So kind of both uh, things going at one time and looking forward to that. It's exciting times here. I uh, want some reminders. I will tell you guys some reminders again. Our command staff meetings, generally every Wednesday morning, generally at 9 o'clock here at headquarters. Uh, that's when we get together and uh, uh, discuss things that, that come up and uh, chief checks on the progress of some of our uh, uh, projects and things like that we're going. So that's where the, the sausage gets made, so to speak. And again, uh, I'm very uh, optimistic because we're having a lot more engagement, which is what I like. Uh, folks are sending me emails, and I'm trying to uh, answer some of the questions and things uh, in, in these briefings or answer them individually, but we, uh, we, I'm glad everybody, the more folks are getting engaged. And again, if you have suggestions, how we can com improve communications, ideas, things like that, just let me know. Uh, and, and again, the goal is for everybody to know what's going on. Uh, it's still possible to ignore everything and not know what's going on, but if you make any reasonable attempt, we sure want to uh, help you do that. If you can think of a different way that we're not doing that that will reach a lot more people, then let us know. We're willing to try anything. Well, that's it for now. So uh, if you would, you guys be safe out there and let me know what you're thinking and let me know uh, if you have any questions.